Good afternoon. This is Kerry from Kerry's Reborn Baby Loves. We have Cookie Monster, or not really, but someone's wearing Cookie Monster. Um, it's been quite a while since I've been on. I'm sorry if anyone has missed me, and if you haven't, you should. We have our beautiful oh, Samuel. He is very rugged up here, as you can see. Um, it was very cold, but we're going to change him and... We've got to show you his new hair. Samuel is this beautiful baby's name. Um, not the sculpt, that's what I called him. Was actually bald, but painted hair, I should say. And we were knocking his clothes off the bed. Um, we've had him for a little, had him back for a little while now, but you know, life happens and we didn't get round to sharing the beautiful hair. So what we're going to do, he has got a lot of bad hair at the moment, but we're going to take Cookie Monster off. Oh, it was very cold. I wouldn't mind a suit like this. Okay. Your shoe, oh, your sock, I should say, not your shoes. we got Cookie Monster shirt on too. Furry friends. So as you can see, he has brown hair. Well, hopefully you can see it is brown hair and he's got a full head of gorgeous brown hair. I'll show you closely when I've brushed it. Um, <laughs> it's a little bit bad hairish, but we won't wake him. We'll keep on changing him. We're going to, um, I don't know if his other outfit I've got for him will fit. It is another Cookie Monster outfit because we do love Cookie Monster too here. So if it doesn't, we'll just have to change into a disposable nappy, I think, instead of a big toweling one. As you know, their bum gets pretty big. I'll cut the singlet off. It's a bit awful with the lighting here, just after lunchtime, and the clouds keep coming out. They're there one minute and gone the next, so... We'll soon see so the lighting isn't very good i apologize oh well it's not my fault really is it so we'll put our little singlet on got to keep the chest warm okay now we've got a little gray long sleeve shirt i like the collars on these because um if you've actually looked for skivvies for bubbies um a hard time finding them don't be little men so these were the next best thing which i did buy from best and less a year or two ago now i'm just grateful that we have a couple okay that squeaking is i'm actually changing him on the bed in auntie deb's bedroom I'll turn you over and do up your buttons You watch me have trouble with these tiny little buttons. Oh, so hopefully everyone has been well. Um, I don't know whether I've mentioned to you or not, but I have been on a cruise. Um, four days, I think it was. It was wonderful. I could go again any old time. Oh, and the food. Oh my gosh. I rolled off the ship. It was awesome. Absolutely beautiful. Restaurant style. Breakfast, lunch, dinner. Afternoon tea, you name it. It was all just scrumptious. I didn't take a baby on with me. I was a bit worried that, um, you know, when I wasn't in the cabin, that um, I might get stolen or something. <laughs> so... Okay, we'll try with this toweling nappy and see how we go. Oh, as you can see, he's full limbs, which is awesome. Okay, little man. I don't remember the last baby that wore this outfit. So I'm pretty sure it will fit him, but you just never know, hey? He might have gained a little bit of weight since... I looked at it last, so it won't 
matter if it doesn't fit in, like if it's too big. Then again, if it's too small, it might even fit Isaac, my tiny little silicon boy. So, pin through. There. So the last video I did, I was showing how I um, was not very happy with Adeline's hair. I have since pulled most of it out. She is wearing a hat. Um, she um, definitely suits hair. It definitely looks a lot better with hair, that kit. So um, when my friend Karen is available again, I will get her to put new hair in for her and hopefully I'll be happy next time. Now, I'm just wondering if this will fit you. could be a bit long. Let me how it is with the straps. It is actually a set of little overalls with Cookie Monster on. With the feet in. So we'll soon see. If it doesn't fit, we'll have to get something else. We'll put this on. I've also sold the crib that um, was Adeline's. I needed the money together with um, the sale of Bethany, who has now gone to her new mum. Um, we do have a new baby, but I'm not going to share her with you today. I'm going to share her once this little man's hair has been shared, because he was next in line. Head round. It's a little bit long here, but anyway... That's okay. Oh, we've got a clip undone there. We've got to fix that up. Oh, they cold drafts. So he does look kind of cute. Cookie Monster. So we'll give him a clean lovey shortly. We don't need that nappy. What I'll do is I'll give his hair a little bit of a spritzy. Just conditioner and water. Not much conditioner because we don't want to make it thick and sticky. Because otherwise you'll end up with too much product in your baby's hair. Arnie Karen who did our hair has done a beautiful job. Might help if I got your hair this time, baby. Okay. So um, I haven't done too many hairstyles with him, just playing around with it because it has been cold and it's not much sense doing an awesome hairstyle when you don't see it under a bonnet or hat. So he looks so cute. He probably looks a little bit older with hair, but I do think it's adorable. It looks really good. He did have to have it done thickly because he's had very thick painted hair. Um, see if we can do a little quiff. It's not incredibly long, it's just thick. So we might just try and... <laughs> not that we can do too much, but it's okay. And get it all up there, little man. Into a little quiff. Oh, we didn't wet the back properly, but that's okay. So, oh, here we go. Here's his beautiful hair. I'll turn you over. Whoop. Didn't brush that area too well. And we've got to tuck the tags in. Oh, my goodness. We could tuck all these tags in. There we go. So, there we go. That isn't a bare patch there. It's just because I haven't wet in that spot. But it is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So, those who know me well know this is my beauty baby. So, um, he's very, very special. Um, <laughs> I suppose that people didn't understand me saying that. He's my go-to baby. Okay, 
get rid of that blanket it's been used and it is dirty so we'll just get this light blue knitted one up we do just put this one down I actually got this one from lifeline which was a bargain I just bring it home and soak them in nappy sand and wash and then we're right to use aren't we so this is Samuel Samuel Thomas and I've already messed your hair up already goodness me not to worry he's not worried at all so that's Samuel's hair now as I haven't been on for ages and ages um we do have a couple and oh excuse me and I just banged the camera sorry we do have a couple of new little things happening I did buy a lovely little one who actually same artist Tiffany Acosta from um, Coco's Nursery. She made this little one too, and I can't remember what her kit name is, sorry. Um, but she's a full limbed mini. I think she's a Merida. No, she's somebody. <laughs> I can't remember. Sorry. I haven't planned on showing her, but I will because she is gorgeous. So, oh. So here she is, little tiny girl, feet, look at the size of them feet, very beautifully painted she is, painted hair, so it was the same artist who did them both and I'm surprised I actually have clothes that fit her, so I'm not really sure how long she, she is, I think she's about 11, 10 inches something. I might just keep your jumper off, Missy Moo, because it is warm. Well, I am anyway. We just put her there. So I actually called this little one Tiff, Tiffany. She's gorgeous. So um, obviously you're not going to be able to see the detail because the camera doesn't show it up properly. But she has more beautiful colouring and even tones. It's just not very good lighting. So hopefully next time I try, the sun will be out. I might try in the morning. But we've got a house inspection tomorrow, so I've been busy cleaning house. Well, it hasn't taken me all morning, but anyway. So we'll put little Tiff back here. Okay. My big head in the road. Back here, Samuel. So we've got to change Samuel's bed because you can't put a clean bubby in a dirty bed. So what we're going to do now. And we hope to maybe uh, pop in again very soon because we're going to have to show off our new big sister. Um, because I have Tabitha has, is with her new mummy and the same mummy is now um bought bethany which was the quinlan sculpt so um the girls are together which is wonderful and so i've got eliza my levi samuel uh he's the manuela manual kit gosh i always get that wrong um and i have my uh 16 inch silicon baby boy and I have Adeline, who is on the other end of the bed, but I won't grab it because I'm going to knock the phone out of the um, hook here in a minute. So, um, yeah, so they're all the bubbies, but we do have one new one which will have her own, I was going to say show, her own segment. So um, hopefully we can share her very soon when I get time. So waiting around for this lady tomorrow from the real estate and... I hope to check in with you all again soon. Whatever you're doing, have a great afternoon. Yeah, that's where it is here in Queensland. So, um, yeah, wherever you are, stay well and talk to you all soon. Thank you for joining me. Bye.